Hello, I'm Rich Dean with West Coast Collector Cars in Oregon. And today, we've got a really cool 1955 Chevrolet Handyman Sedan Delivery to show you. Now, I'm kind of using two terms there, and here's why. This car started life as a Handyman, which would have had back windows on the side, but it's since been modified to create a Sedan Delivery, which wouldn't have windows. So, I wanted, to, wanted you to know that. Uh, at any rate, very cool hot rod, very nicely restored, it's beautiful. I want to take you around and show you just how nice it is, I think you'll agree, very cool. Now, finished off paint-wise in this nice cream color, and it is a base coat clear coat, and you might be able to tell here, uh, you can see the depth there, you can see my hand, but very nice, hood aligns nicely, can't really see the depth here, it's so bright and sunny out that, you know, you hard to see with that cream color but all the uh, trim and bright work is nice you got this little contrasting double pinstripe here you might be able to tell that's a little darker and then this one's a little bit lighter kind of in a uh, oh a light tannish color and the pinstripe uh, is throughout the the wagon you'll see it as we go along here but all of the trim, again, all of the bright work is beautiful on it. There's no dings anywhere on it. It's really, it's really beautiful. Notice the new whiskers here in the doors. The glass is all new. It's tinted. It's did an excellent job on it. Take you inside the interior on the passenger side here. All the weather stripping, nice and pliable, clean. Finished off in this uh, tan vinyl and then they painted the uh, inside trim to match. Did an excellent job on it. As you can see, you know, in the jams here. Carpeting is nice quality carpeting. Finished off here even. These seats are really cool looking and they're comfortable. They installed seat belts. Uh, it's got a little center console that uh, is removable if you wanted it to be, but uh, door opens. Stereo is uh, mounted here, and it utilizes this remote here uh, for the stereo. Take a look back there. You can see those uh, bow tie emblems embossed into the side, all finished professionally. Nice carpeting back there on the flooring. And look how nice the headliner is. Beautiful. Little dome light working like it should. Visors. I mean, it just, uh, they did a really, really nice job on it. Nice and even here. Again, I get down here to the stainless. And they ran this pinstriping around the stainless trim. You know, if a person wanted to, you could actually use this to advertise your business, you know. Do something here with your business logo or whatever it is uh, your business is or put something on the door. Back here, again, all the chrome, the bumpers, all the trim and stainless. Very nice. This is very darkly tinted, as you can see. And this classic pinstriping here. You open this up. All kinds of possibilities back here, whatever you wanted to do, but importantly, look how clean and nice they did in here. Painted everything. Nice shut lines here as well. Again, we've got pinstriping above the tail lights, all the chrome around the tail lights, and the tail lights all replaced, all new, nice weather stripping, everything. Notice a little uh, fuel door here. They put a little, somebody painted a little mural on there uh, with the beach scene, and that, of course, being a wagon, literally a wagon. So I guess we could call this a surf wagon. 
The wheels and tires, uh, these are, uh, you know, basically a Chevy Rally, but they've got this nice trim ring here and the uh, derby cap with the bow tie, and these are uh, BF Goodrich radial TAs all around. This car drives down the road very nicely. It's got power brakes. does not have power steering, but it does have power brakes. All new wiring, you know, it's got the newer, uh, if you'll go to the website, uh, westcoastcollectorcars.com, I've got pictures, of course, of the wagon. you got to check the undercarriage. I mean, it is clean under there. Nicely painted. You know, very nice. And then the wiring, I got a shot of the uh, fuse block, which, you know, I wanted to show you that because it utilizes the new fuses, you know. So you're not going to have any wiring issues with this. All your window cranks and, uh, you know, door latches and so forth are just excellent. Look at this, all brand new, all nice. Uh, the gauges are auto meter and they're antique faced. Uh, you've got a nice arrangement there of gauges. They all work. The transmission is a 700 R4 uh, automatic with overdrive. So of course we all love that. That's a nice feature for rolling down the, the freeway. Uh, the differential is uh, the uh, period uh, Chevy, you know, had the dropout pumpkin and uh, they're, you know, probably about a three to one gearing I would guess you know based on just driving it and so forth it's not geared real low it's more you know for freeway or highway driving that type of thing it does have a tilt column also and that nice wooden steering wheel dash is nicely painted it's a nice wagon. Again, doors close easy, nice shut lines. Up front here, again, you know, all your trim and bright work, as nice as it can be. Not pitted. If anything, it's new, but I mean everything. From the headlight doors to your trim around, you know, here, all your lenses are nice and new. The bumpers look nice, you got the bumperettes. Uh, the grill, excellent. This is a uh, car club in Long Beach, California called the Renegades. Let me uh, open the hood over here. Nice quality, nice radiator with the nice overflow tank. This is a 350. Uh, nicely rebuilt. Aluminum manifold, nice little holly carb with a uh, electric choke, which works great. Uh, electronic ignition. All the, notice how clean this is, but all the suspension was rebuilt, of course, and new shocks. MSD box. Uh, you have power brakes here. They're not discs, they're drums, but they are power and they work great. Up under the hood, nice and clean and finished. You notice this nice satin finish, you'll see that under the car too. Firewalls nice and clean. They use nice components here for the steering. Nice clean shroud. This is a nice wagon as you can see. But what I'd like to do now is I'll hop in the wagon and I'll start it up, get to hear it run. I'm just gonna drive it around the parking lot so you can kind of see what it looks like, you know, and, and sounds like moving under its own power. But uh, yeah, it's pretty nice.
nice tight steering radius on it. And you know, I told you it doesn't have power steering, but you know, it steers really easily. It, it really does. And even with this smaller steering wheel on it, you know, if you had a big steering wheel, it'd be really easy, but it really steers nice and it, it drives nicely. It's a really cool wagon. Um, yeah, but if I can answer any further questions for you, you know, about this uh, now sedan delivery, please don't hesitate to give me a call. Again, my name is Rich Dean and this is West Coast Collector Cars. My number is 503-851-6763 and thank you for watching today.